Houston, uh, Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. Good evening, folks, and welcome to Alien Addict. I want to discuss with you unidentified, but I'm going to keep it quite simple. I'm not going to go too far into it. I'm not going to go too far in depth with it. I'm going to keep it as close to the bone as I possibly can, because I think we need to have a little bit of a reality check right now. Now, I did um, a, a live stream the other night, and I've actually deleted it now, well, I've uh, made it private uh, because I was quite, um, I was had a little bit to drink. I think my neighbours might go and play tonight because I've been very loud. Oh my God, I look really, I look quite attractive in this light. I'm liking this. I'm liking this. Because normally I'm in black and white, you know, and now I'm seeing myself finally in colour. It's just, it's magnificent. And I don't really do many videos where I've had a drink now for obvious reasons. Well, a little tipple, but we've just been having a discussion. And Stu's he's getting pissed off with the videos that I'm doing about Tom DeLong Because he says he's a wanker. I kind of just shout my mouth off without thinking and going into depth with it. Well, I'm thinking now and I'm... I'm still disappointed in the fact that we never saw anything to do with the Adam Project. Now this, pro the Adam Project, if you don't know what it is in uh, to the Stars Academy world, is they have a load of objects and they are doing tests on them. Now whether these are pieces that have fallen off... Um, alien spacecraft, whether it's just bits of meteorites or just bits of unknown metal uh, or elements or whatever. We didn't hear anything to do with that. Now, that must be coming in season two, I hope. But that disappointed me. I wanted to see something to do with that. And I, I heard that they had that weird thing which i'll leave a, a a picture of it round about here i put it about yeah i put it there exactly there i put it there um that thing uh, i was hoping that they would show a bit more on that now that it's been spoke about before and it's been left for years and then i find out to the stars academy has that object and nothing got said Back to the actual eyewitness reports and the guys that were doing the analysis of the the, the objects and they, they stated that there's no way that we have anything that can do manoeuvres like that. At that speed, at that velocity, whatever. It can't do it. Now these, these are credible people. Speaking about this, there's a lot of credible people in this um, documentary. But here's my problem, and call me paranoid. Yes, I know I'm paranoid. Um, but it just seems to be that we are kind of being drip fed disclosure now. But Where's the agenda? There is an agenda. Definitely is. 100% there is an agenda. And who's in on it? And who's being actually used? Now, one thing I found extremely strange in the whole of the unacknowledged, unidentified um, documentary was the fact that Tom DeLong was just quiet he must have said about 10 words in total it, it was all Lou and I, I, I think the guy does a great job don't get me wrong Lou, Lou's fantastic at what he does you know he's definitely selling it to us um, but this was Tom's project it was Tom's baby it was Tom's company if that was me I'd be like well hang about this is my company, this is my dream, this is what I wanted to do for the community, for, for, for 
the entire world and I've just got to stay quiet now? You know, I kind of felt for him. I, maybe that's the way he wants it. Maybe he's kind of like, nah, you know what? I've, I went on Joe Rogan. I spoke about my penis. Um, and that's kind of it for me, you know. I get carried away. Lou, can you take the reins, please? Maybe that's exactly what's happened. But I do, I'm, ve I'm a very suspicious man. Very suspicious. Hey, hey, I, do you remember? <coughs> what the do you remember, I, I did say that Bob Lazar, mark my words, will be on Joe Rogan. Sure, sure enough, a, a month after I put that video out, Bob Lazar is on Joe Rogan. Call me psychic or just that Jeremy Corbell just te constantly texts me information. He doesn't. He doesn't. I don't think he knows who I am. It was obvious. I, I'm sure you're going to say, mate, come on. We all knew that. We all knew that Bob would end up going on Joe Rogan. It was in inevitable, completely. Now, here's my, back to the unidentified and the reason why I've mentioned Bob Lazar is this all seems to be coming at once. We're, we seem to be getting, uh, that drip has turned into a nice steady trickle now of information that we're all getting. And I'm kind of asking myself why. Why is, is it the people at the top of the triangle that is making this happen? And that, you, you know, no, it's not flat. It's not. But I do believe that there are people at the top. And who knows? Tom, Lou, Bob. They could be being told to go on these shows to do these things or recommended uh, I don't know I would like to think that Tom DeLong is in all this because he's massively into ufology he's addicted to the subject and he wants the world to be a better place I would like to think that Bob Lazar worked at Area 51 shit himself that's not why he left, because he sh shit himself, but he shit himself because he was in deep shit and he's totally telling the truth about the nine spacecraft that they had in them hangars. I would love to say 100% that I believe everything these people say to me. And if you do believe everything that these people say to you then you have so much faith it is unreal because you cannot trust anybody you really can't you and i think i think that tom the long lou bob lazar hal whoever would probably agree and say you're right you cannot trust us because you do not have the hard evidence. Until a UFO comes down, it lands on my lawn, an alien gets out, takes a piss on my garden, and then buggers off back home, I will be forever skeptical. Now I've seen things in the sky and I do have some photographs, believe it or not, that look extremely shit. Which is why I've never put them out. I probably will show them in a video and try and explain what I saw. But I saw something go in and out of a cloud once. I was at traffic lights driving. And I think at the time... it. It was, you're not supposed to use your phone while driving, and I didn't. I was pulled up, but I literally got my phone for a split second, took some snaps out of the window, looked back at them, and you can see the object. But if I show you the object, it just looks like a shiny ball. That's all it looks like, which could be a balloon or anything, you know, it, but I know what I saw, and I know how fast it was moving, it did, well, I don't know how fast it was moving, but 
it looked like something, you know? I'm not a bullshitter. But I, I'm not going to give you, I can't give you that evidence. And this could be the same situation with To The Stars Academy with Bob Lazar. They cannot give you the hard-hitting evidence. I mean, the Element 115, yeah, that's that's now, there is, we know there's the Element 115, he was right about that. He was right about Area 51. Um uh, he was right about the uh, the hand detector. Um, you know, there's a lot of things that 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 have, see that I think wow, there's truth there. Same with to the Stars Academy, exactly the same. But there's so many people that are just jumping on this band, bandwagon. They're just jumping on it, and they are like, you cannot say shit about these people without them just giving you. A world of hurt because you disagree or you have a different opinion on disclosure or any of the of or, or a company or anything you, you, you know if you trust everybody and you're gonna say this guy's Illuminati because he's doing that with his finger I do with that with my finger people do that it means means bugger all it's just me just chilled um, but yeah, don't trust anybody until you have evidence. I thought the show was great, by the way. Unidentified, I thought it was a fantastic show. It kept me entertained. I thought that Bob Lazar and Jeremy Cordell, Corbell's documentary was fantastic. It kept me entertained. Do I believe everything that these people are telling me no because i have a mind of my own and until i see the evidence with my own eyes and i'm not talking about if we see something in the sky over the next year or so that's in a remote dest destination that gets on the news that comes out that there is something in the skies visiting our planet and it's real. I have to see it. I can't. I'm not going to see it on the news and say that's real until I see it. I have to see it. I'm not going to see a video. I'm not going to see a picture. I want to see it myself. So I need to get out there. In the hood. Under the hood. No, in the hood. Just in the field. I still need to go to Rendlesham Forest. I've told you, I keep saying this. I need to get myself out to Rendlesham Forest because that is weird. I was born in December, 1980, in Rendlesham Forest. I was left in a paper bag. And my mum found me. But no, I haven't been returned yet. No, it, I actually was born in 1980, in December 1980. Um, so yeah, there's a, there's a good chance that I am um, an alien. I'm just a bullshit like everybody else. Good night, God bless. Mind the bugs don't bite. I want to see your comments below to what you think is going on with Disclosure, what you thought of the show, Unidentified, because I will be doing a um, review of the documentary with Osvaldo Franco when he can uh, get on here, when we can, when our time scales match up. Um, but yeah, don't trust anything that you see, that you read. Trust your eyeballs, trust your nose, trust the feelings. If you feel something, you know, if you feel it, it's probably real. If you see it with your own eyes, it may, it may not be real. You need to get close. If you smell it, it's definitely real. You know, if you, you, you could smell that alien um, BO, uh, you know, there's no other smell like it. Good night, God bless. Mind the bugs don't bite. I'm Alien Andy. Like, share, subscribe, and yes, um, I've got nothing more to say. <laughs>